Ooh. Hello guys. All right, so this is how you do upload studio. First, you, you first you select the intro. It's very easy to do this. Um, you can make it your own by adding text and you know, or giving a, giving a shout out to your YouTube. Sometimes I just put my YouTube name on it. I put my gamer tag then my YouTube name. Then you next you what? Next you hit add text and then you type in the title of the video. This is I'm picking the intro part. So this first part I'm gonna figure out. Uh, I'm gonna type in my intro like so and then I'll finish this up. Let's wait for it. I can't stand texting on the fucking Xbox One. It sucks. I probably need to get a little keyboard or something. But anyway, that's my title intro. Um, you could press X to play it. As you can see below the intro, there are buttons like LB, RT. I, I mainly use LB and RB to fast forward and X to play. Next, um, you hit these little plus signs at the bottom to add another clip. Like, okay, I go into my game DVR. That's where I recorded my clips. Most of the clips going to be without sound. Um, the only sound that we'll be playing is like the game sound. So... If you make a video with your friends or whatever, you um, make sure you have them go into game chat. Make sure you take your radars off and er everything. Oh my God, this, let me mute this. Well, that's probably, it's probably, that's it, whatever. Anyway, so I pulled up my clip and it added my clip. So I have the intro, then the clip added from the game DVR. You also can remove it if you don't like it. You can just remove, just play with the different functions. It's really easy. I mean like really easy. So I'm playing my, I press X to play my clip right now. Um, I don't like the way it looks so I go to trim so I can edit it or cut it down to get the parts to delete the parts I don't want in it um, I, I think you used yeah it, you see how it says L and R you move the left and the right thumbstick or joystick whatever they call these little things on the controller to clip it and just play press X to, or preview I mean Y to preview to see how it look if you like how how it looks then then you hit accept I think you hit a to accept after you like the clip that you chosen oh I'm sorry about this controller sound I'm playing <laughs> I'm doing heist because it's the double RP for Pacific standard I'm so excited oh okay he blew that up all right um next Next, we go to, let me see, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm recording this while I'm, Jesus, it's taking too long for me to get to the next part. Okay, somebody died in the heist. <laughs> you guys can't see that. That makes no fucking sense, these idiots. It's easy. It's fucking easy. Anyway, um, yeah, so, um, took me about an hour to clip this, cut this down, just this one little clip, because I was getting pissed off, and I was getting frustrated. Um, I don't know what these dudes doing on this heist, they even ran all the way to the, okay, you know what, where's everybody? Now, as you can see, um, I'm a little backwards, but this is part of the game DVR um, all you have to do is go to I think my app my apps and games and then or snap the party and then hit left with it or right with the joystick and go down to game DVR or go I think game DVR is mainly in my apps and games as you see I was trying to act out a scene 
and get my actors to talk or whatever. But mind you, they cannot the um it's not recording their voices. What I was doing, I was I was recording their voices myself. Like you could record your friends' voices from the mic, from your headset, and then like record it on like your smartphone or something, and then play it back. Oh my God, they failed the heist. And that's the leader. He failed it. But anyway, so they did a good job. Um, thank you, actors, whoever these people are. It sounds like D-Lo and somebody else. Who is that other actor? I have no idea who that other actor is. Well, anyway, we was trying to do a scene from Friday, but that didn't work out. Because <laughs> people are so, they have ADD. The people that play GTA 5 has ADD. I'm telling you. That's no lie. Including me. No. <laughs> anyway, um, so I ended the clip. And it's saved. Um, you can record, I think, up to 10 minutes or something. Or I can't remember how long you can record. I think it was on the screen. But anyway... Next thing, um, I, this is where I'm telling my actors, great job, and you guys are number one, and stuff like that, and thank you so much for acting in my mood. Okay, I'm lying. Anyway, so I have the clip ready, and now is the best part. It's, it's kind of the easiest part. We just, you just use your headset, and it's really, like, you would do real good if you have, like, one of those turtle beaches or whatever. What I would do is I would hit the record button and then I would play. Like if you want to do a music video, you could play your song into the headset. Or if you recorded your friend's voices for the scene, like with your smartphone. Because sometimes the smart, like the i, what is it, the iPad or the iPhone, they have a button where you can record a memo or something. And if your headset's really good and your friends are really loud, you can record their voices from your headset. Instead, if you don't have a game capture or the luxury of a game capture or Elgato or any of that, just record that. You can record it from your headset. Like uh, my friend Kibo, she has a really good mic. She can hear everything that we're saying. Like if she turned up her mic, she probably could still hear us through the ear, the ear part. But um, here you can record your voice. You can do voiceover. You can do commentary. Um, you also can, um, but, um, I think it, you can do your own voices or whatever, but you just got to come up and use your imagination and come up with ideas. Right here, um, I didn't record my voice or whatever. I was trying to record like a Dora the Explorer song, but I was having problems with my mic because I have that attachment adapter mic. Hopefully, um, my next upload will be, like, louder because of this mic. Because I, um, I connected my 360 headset to this mic. So, um, I plan on uploading the video soon. So, I'm very excited. So, the song is playing right now. As you can see, the little, the little um, thing is moving up and down. So, I did a good job with the recording. I'm happy with it. I'm pretty... There it goes. <laughs> yeah, this heist is so hard. But anyway, so I'm finished. So after I finish, I upload it. Oh, excuse me. So after I finish, I hit finish, and then it takes a minute to, um, Render, I think that's the word. You can enter tags, but they don't give you a lot of tagging options to get your stuff seen. But you enter tags or whatever, and then you can hit upload. It's um, I think like the best way to upload is to the cloud. Also, log into your Twitter on Xbox and upload it to Twitter because they really be looking on Twitter. Um, there was something else I wanted to say. 
yeah upload studio is a great way to get a fan base especially if you're an up-and-coming youtuber you probably want to um use upload studio to get more followers i'm just i'm about to hit 800 followers on xbox i love it um because those 800 followers i could just go into the activity feed and tell them to go look at my youtube channel and they probably would if they're bored or if they like really active fans they'll go look and i really appreciate that but um sorry about this being so sh a shitty tutorial but Hope you get the idea of Upload Studio because it's fun. Um, it's fun. Um, you can be creative, come up with ideas or whatever. Uh, I'm so happy I finally hit 2K subscribers. Thank you so much, you guys. Um, and I'm trying. I'm coming up with new little series. Uh, also, Bad Girls Clubs coming. Another episode coming soon. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.